Now then YouTube, I am the tough man, welcome to this, this is Euro 2012, the overpriced FIFA 12 DLC, or should I say that's what I'm here to actually uh, show you guys the content, I'm still on the back end of this annoying cough, so if I start coughing, just ignore it, it will pass. Um, yes, there is subject, you know, <coughs> <coughs> There's a lot of debate about whether or not this is worth 1,800 points because I do FIFA for YouTube. I said that I download it, you know, regardless of the price, so that you guys can see exactly what you're going to get for your money and whether or not it's going to be worth it. So first and foremost, this is a, after a little bit of an intro, not much really, but you come to this screen. This first thing, text language, English of course, commentary language. French, imagine that. English, thank you. The commentary language contains new new content unique to Euro 2012. So there's 1,800 points right there. Alright. Um, select my favourite nation. is obviously England. <laughs> Five footballs. I don't think so. Better in attack than defence. Don't we'll download the squads because it asks us to do that. <coughs> right, the first thing I'm going to get to is expedition mode. I said originally that I was going to do the Euro 2012 straight off the bat, but I'm not going to do that. I figure that you guys will probably be thinking, hmm, I think this might be the best mode to see first. So, without further ado, let's go on with the expedition mode. Welcome to Expedition. In Expedition, you'll be able to build a fantasy team while exploring Europe. You will start by choosing your favourite player or virtual pro as the captain, customising your team name and look, and selecting your starting group. The rest of your squad will be initially made of reserve players, randomly picked from all UEFA nations. The map okay. is the main hub for your expedition, where you can see your current location on each group and strategise your next moves. Nations and groups will be unlocked as you defeat more and more nations for the first time. Winning games will also award you with the ability to build a road between your current location and any unlocked nation within the group. Build Roads the road. are important because you can only attempt to move and play against another nation in the same group if there is a road directly connected to it. Because of course you match, don't have roads. nation will be the defeated nation. Lose the match and stay where you are. Be careful. <laughs> Losing a match may also penalise you with the destruction of a road. Oh my god, with each match you win, roads. you'll be rewarded with a player from the defeated nation. This way you can improve your squad and construct a fantasy team of your favourite players. The first time you beat a nation, you'll receive a reserve player, the second time a substitute, and the third time a starting 11 player. You can take this player by discarding one from your squad, or you can completely reject it. By winning okay. matches, you will also acquire pieces of a mosaic. Beat all 53 nations three times each to collect all what? the pieces and reach the ultimate goal of discovering the final image on the completed mosaic. It's time to begin your European expedition. Defeat all 53 nations to dominate Europe. All 53 nations, three times. You got 100 odd ma 150 odd matches. <coughs> right, so of course my virtual pro is a left back. And um, that's from my pro days, I might have to actually sort that out, but uh, never mind. In fact, I'll do that in just a second. Um, yeah, I'm using my virtual pro anyway, I'm not going to use that. Any accomplishments earned with the Virtual Pro and Expedition will not be saved until you exit Euro 2012 and return to the FIFA 12 menu. Okay. So, we've gathered that, that Europe don't have roads. Um, apparently we're in the Dark Ages again. We've got to build roads. And if we lose a football match, the authorities are going to come along and just destroy the road because of, we've lost a football match. Team name, hey, you to say that'll do. Um, Crest, let's have a look here, see what we've got. See what legendary thing that we can make here. There you go. Oh, that's the one right there. That's the one, fellas. I'm liking the look of that. Oh, yeah, look at that. Yeah, it's the way forwards. Right, home kit. Let's see what ridiculous kit we can get. Um, come on, give it, there we are. Oh, that's it. The seal's coming. Right, well, what's this badge? It's that yellow colour, isn't it? I think the second big colour is going to be that black. That was uh, decent. 
What's this then? Oh, the bat, the fucking night thing. Oh, that's gonna be black as well. I'll do. Shots. Are they black or are they just on the edge of it? Can't really see. Oh, that's black, isn't it? There we are. No, I don't know. Jesus Christ, I look like an idiot with the red boozy bags there. I can't see bugger all in the black, so... White it is. Socks! Where's that yellow colour? Gold. That looks different to the other one. It is. I don't know if I'm entirely liking that, to be honest. Oh yeah, it's not too bad. Okay, that's the kit style and colours. Oh, they work it now. Okay, what are we going to look like? Hmm. I'm tempted to go for something similar to what the home kit's like. Oh my god, we'll customise all these. Luckily I know what I'm doing now. Come on, black, where are you? There it is. Okay. Oh no, I'm sponsored by EA Sports. I'm bound to get fucked up. It's black, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, red, I can hear you. Oh. Okay. Let's whip across here to the black. Oh no, I don't want it black, do I? I want it white for that one. Um, sock colours. Come on. So, my home kit's sponsored by Nike. My uh, away kit's sponsored by EA Sports. Because we all love EA Sports. There's nothing wrong with them at all. Uh, okay, we've got all our... In fact, I best do some totally fucking different colour, aren't I? Just in case there's like kit clashes and stuff. Well, that looks alright. Well, that totally different kit in a matter of seconds. There we are. Lovely. Oh, and it goes with my badge as well. Fucking brilliant. Amazing. So that's what we've got. That's the squad. Get in. Look at that. Um, right, we've got, I would best get used to these. Nudson in goal. Um, Silage. So, oh my god. You need another tongue just to pronounce half of these. Um, Chiriches. I think that is. From Romania. Cask. Marmara. On the right. Kovar. It's defensive mid. Tribunier. Tribo. <laughs> Tree ball, extra strong mints on the left. Uh, boost sets, boost, whatever it is, boost, boo guy. In there, We've got Cleeper and Faz up front. That's not gonna fucking, you know, it's not gonna stay like that because I am, of course, gonna put myself up front because that is where I play. I'm only in, in uh, defence to get my attributes up in defence anyway. Substitutes, Turgard, Filipov. Uh, Delavio, I like that name. That's all right, isn't it? Um, but it's shit. Uh, Chris, Chris Mundson, Catterall, uh, Stavru, and Kuta, Kutaja. Yes. Oh fuck me! I can randomise it again. What? Isn't fair. Oh, we should have a bloody press out now. We'll have to go and press stuff, don't I? Uh, let me just see. Uh, Mohamedov. I can imagine shouting that, so I'm going to keep that. That's the squad. That's the squad that's going to do it for us, fellas. 4 1 2 1 2. That's the one that I use. Starting group. Oh my god. Shall I be in England? Look how difficult that group is compared with some of them. Look at that bullshit. Croatia's <coughs> <coughs> Croatia's the highest one in that one. Um, 
looking along here. I want to be in Spain's group. But I don't like the look of the other ones, to be honest. Scotland's. Uh, who should we be? Um, I think F. I'm going to go with F. We're in group F, fellas. Uh, right, that's the first part over and done with. I'm going to uh, exit here and change my player around and then we will be back to continue on with this epic journey.